I'm Gabby, and with my husband Ben, we are on an epic road trip across California. After spending a few days in LA with a mandatory stop in Disneyland, we picked up a camper van and drove to the desert. We spent the last few days in Joshua Tree, and we now have made our way to Death Valley. We have made it to Death Valley, and this is our very glamorous <laughs> camping spot for the night. So we are at a first come first serve campground just by the service center of Furnace Creek, and it's just this massive parking lot full of RVs. Please, we have little toilets there. The view is pretty incredible. You ready for a fun night in Dead Valley, Ben? Yeah, woo! Dead Valley. Woo <laughs> it has been a pretty long driving day. We drove about four hours to get here, most of it in the middle of nowhere, by ourselves, no, nothing around us. So it feels pretty good to be surrounded by people. So we're just gonna set up shop, have dinner, get a early night in, because tomorrow we are waking up for sunset at Zabriskie Point. So uh, yeah, let's uh, let's set our camp. This is our little dinner setup for tonight. So we stopped at Trader Joe's on our way here. Love Trader Joe's as a Canadian, we don't have that. So excited to go there. And we have some tortellini with pesto. And we just bought the essential for the next few days. And right now I wanna eat this. I bought some crackers, so we're gonna I'm gonna try this. And I got some everything but the bagel to go with them. Let's try a cracker by itself, doing a taste test. Yummy cracker, now to dip. Okay. Mmm, this is so good. Cheers. Cheers. To not dying in Death Valley. To not dying in Dead Valley. Yep. <laughs> How is dinner looking, Ben? Oh, magnifique. <laughs> so we set up the table in the camper, just because it's a bit dark. And we have tortellini, some salad, a beer. This is good. sunrise at the brisky point all right we're all packed up we cleaned up a little bit after breakfast. We saw at like the end of the campsite, there is like massive sinks to do our dishes. So we're just gonna drive there, do our dishes, and then go on some hikes. Having a quick lunch stop in the van in the parking lot of the sand dunes which is going to be our next exploring 
area. But we just stopped first for sandwiches, just with what we had, and we bought some like potato salad and dip at Trader Joe's yesterday. And yeah, it's gonna be a quick lunch because it is very hot in here. So we at least we are in the shade as we're in the van, but we won't stay here too long. Park keeps amazing me. We see a spot, I'm like, wow, extraordinary. We see another one, I'm like, wow, even better. And here we are today, I'm like, even better. This is, this is so cool. Whew. All right, that's a wrap on the dunes. It's been incredible, definitely worth all the sand and the shoes. This blue Powerade is delicious right now. And we have one last stop today, which is Mosaic Canyon. Canyon was very pretty. It's a longer trail that is available if you want to. However, we're kind of tired, so we just did the first bit to go see what they call the Narrows. So, success, and we made it to like a canyon, which was beautiful. And now we're tired. We're gonna go back to the van and uh, probably try to get a shower, rest a bit, get a snack. And then it's gonna be our last night in Death Valley. Hey guys, so we're back at the campsite after a very fun day of exploring Death Valley and this is our last night in Death Valley and our last night in the desert so I'm going to be wrapping up this video but just before I do so I wanted to give you a few tips from things I've learned in the past few days. So we were able to take a shower. We are staying like I said before at the Sunset Campground and right across the street is the ranch which is like basically a resort like a beautiful resort it even has a golf course and over there you can buy a shower pass it's $15 for a full day and it's basically kind of a hotel kind it gives you access to the pool section which has showers so we bought two of those but I'm sure just one and then you can kind of share it if you're with somebody else would have been uh, more than enough so just good to know $14 for a shower pass and that lasts a full day so if you get it in the morning uh, it's from like 8 a.m. until they close the pool, I think at 11 p.m. Another maybe tip, we got very lucky in our timing here. We are here when it's uh, almost the new moon. So it was new moon like two days ago. So the moon for the past two nights has been tiny, 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 which is perfect for seeing all the beautiful stars at night. So if you can plan your trip, around the moon if you want to watch the stars that can be uh, definitely worth it a few things as well i've noticed about the park so i was told Death Valley, when you come here, there's no water, no food, so make sure you have plenty of that. Make sure your tank of gas is full. There's nothing here. Completely false. Uh, there's, we saw two gas stations through the park. At the resort, there is like a restaurant, an ice cream shop, so there are things in the park. So still good to fill up on the essentials, but it's not 
<laughs> it's not actually dead in here. There is plenty of life around. The past few days in the desert have been extraordinary. I am so grateful to be doing this trip. This is not the end of this California road trip. We need to make our way to San Francisco by end of this week. If you want to watch all of these videos, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you enjoyed this few days in the desert video, please give it a thumbs up. It makes such a big difference for me. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.